the current NCC deemed to satisfy provisions or DTS provisions for car park fire safety are based on research undertaken in the 1980s. That research underpins the NCC concession for open deck car parks accommodating more than 40 cars to not require a sprinkler system. This research also supports several NCC concessions for sprinkler protected open deck car parks by reducing the fire ratings and providing an allowance for bare steel elements. These concessions have enabled the economical design and construction of numerous steel car park structures throughout Australia. But a lot has changed since then. The fuel load within modern vehicles has increased considerably, mainly due to the increased use of plastics. New technologies like electric vehicles, hydrogen powered cars and car stackers have also been introduced. In recognition of the developments in modern vehicles and car park usage, we're proposing changes to reduce the fire related risks in modern car parks. In developing these proposed changes, we consulted with our peak technical committee, the Building Codes Committee, or BCC, as well as key stakeholders, including the Society of Fire Safety, the Australian Steel Institute, the Master Builders Association, the Property Council of Australia, the National Council for Fire and Emergency Services, and Consult Australia. In terms of the detail, firstly, we're proposing the code require sprinkler protection in all car parks with more than 40 cars. This would be irrespective of whether they meet the NCC definition of open deck or not. Sprinkler protection will also be required to car stackers located in car parks. Next, the existing fire resistance level, or FRL concessions, will be removed for certain car parks. This includes the FRL concession for open deck car parks in buildings of type A and type B construction. To use the concessions, this means the car park will need to be sprinkler protected. The FRL concession for sprinkler protected car parks in buildings of type A construction, which are located below another classification, will also be removed. These changes modernise the NCC and will result in improved fire safety of car parks and the occupants located in and adjacent to these buildings. Car parks located below other classifications in multi-storey buildings of type A construction will not be able to use the reduced FRL concessions. However, analysis and consultation showed that this concession is typically not used in these situations, so the impact will be likely cost neutral. These are also cost increases expected when a sprinkler system is required for car stackers and multi-storey open deck car parks. However, these increases are offset by the overall benefits of the proposed changes. If you'd like to provide feedback on this proposed change, visit our dedicated PCD page, abcb.gov.au forward slash PCD. Here you'll find links to the draft changes for volumes one, two and three, and the housing provisions. You'll also find links to support materials and technical documents to help you understand the proposed changes. Finally, this page has a link to our consultation page where you can have your say. The public consultation is open from 1 May to 1 July 2024. We look forward to your input.